Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 13th, okay? Right around the 13th. So we're just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you, okay? So this reading may or may not be for you, and the timing could play out at any time in the near future if it is, okay? So what do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? Three of Wands. Three of Wands. So it feels like somebody has gotten prepared. They're ready. They're ready. They've made some sort of decision. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready to, to walk down that path of focusing on the future. This is somebody who has made up their mind. Here they come. Here they come. Knight of Cups, Knight of Cups. So this is making an approach, you know, a heartfelt gesture. Um, could be some sort of love, an offer of love, or an invite, or something like that. Knight of Cups. This is going after love, going after love, searching for love, looking for love. I mean, the Knight of Cups, I mean, that's like, I think this is like, re, 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 I think this is a dove, releasing a, a dove, I believe. Which symbols love. There is love here. We have the Ace of Cups. This is a, I feel like we have a new start in love. There's somebody who's going to be acting on their feelings. Here they come. Expressing feelings of some sort, perhaps. Somebody could be receiving a gift, even. Whatever it is, it's love. It's a, it's a loving energy. Magician reversed. Hmm. Oh, no. Yeah, it is a magician reversed. High priestess. High priestess. So, if we had this, there's some sort of mystery here. There's like a mysterious, this is very mysterious. It's intense as well. There could be some sort of deep, intense interaction on this day. There could even be some like telepathic communication of some sort. There's obviously a deep connection here. Magician reverse could be unplanned. Something is unplanned. Unaware. Magician reverse, unaware. Some, some, there's some sort of, but the high priestess is very intuitive. Maybe we have somebody here that is unaware that somebody is coming, even though they are extremely intuitive. Maybe they've sensed that this was coming, but wasn't sure. There is, there is love right here. There's, this is an offer or an invite or expressing feelings. This is a decision that has been made. These cards just fell out. The Queen of Wands, Five of Swords, Four of Swords reversed, and the King of Wands. So it could be, it's a perfect match. We have the Queen of Wands and the King of Wands. We have a perfect match here. These two people are both very passionate. They have a lot in common. There's been some sort of isolation. Somebody may be cutting out another person. You know, cutting out another woman. Just being honest. Um, somebody is coming to the rescue. It's in the nick of time as well. It's like, it's, it is definitely in the nick of time, okay? It absolutely is in the nick of time. 
somebody is maybe maybe stopping another person because this five of swords is pointed at the queen of wands it's like stopping somebody stopping somebody from from something we definitely have a deep attraction here we have a very attractive individual here that is probably getting a lot of attention of swords that sword is pointed this is like I want to win I want to win we got somebody here who wants to win they're 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 sick of waiting or I, I feel like there's somebody here that has been waiting because of that three of wands as well and the four of swords reverse there's been some sort of isolation but this person is coming in the nick of time it is literally in the nick of time Whoever they're dealing with is uh, in a very powerful position because of all the red. There's some sort of seductiveness here as well. Taking action. We have somebody here that is taking action right now. This person is, is coming. They're coming to help. They're coming to save. They're, they're about to do something. It's, it feels like... It feels like they need to... Uh, maybe they need to prove themselves or, they, or they're going to prove themselves. They want to win. They want to win. They may want to push somebody else away. They, maybe they're pushing somebody else away. Somebody is being pushed away. Expressing feelings to this strong, attractive, powerful individual. Four of Swords reversed. This is extremely fed up. We got somebody here that is sick of just not doing anything you know they're sick of it they're sick of just laying there they're sick of the dead end they're sick of feeling empty and lost inside this is this is wanting more i believe we want somebody here that wants more we may have somebody here that is that is uh needing some help or something they're needing some help and help is arriving i believe there's some sort of help arriving um, we have somebody here that has been in their ego as well. They've been in their ego. They haven't been taking any action. Maybe it's because they're dealing with a very powerful, strong individual. I don't know if there's some sort of intimidation here. Somebody may be intimidated. But we do have a perfect match. We have, it is definitely a perfect match. Somebody has been struggling. They've been struggling with taking action. But there's some sort of deep connection. Somebody's about to reveal something that they have been keeping to themselves. There's probably going to be a rival, Three of Wands, next to the Knight of Cups. This is an arrival or it's messages or something like that. Because a bird, any kind of bird is a message. Somebody's going to get messages of love. It could even be an arrival with a knight. There's movement. Somebody is headed towards this very attractive individual that is... There's a, there's a, there's a feeling of... I don't know. It feels very lusty. It does feel very lusty. It feels very passionate. It is very passionate. I just looked on the bottom, we got the chariot, which is taking a ride, taking a journey, going someplace. There could definitely be an arrival. Somebody is determined. They are determined to have victory. They're determined to win. This is somebody is, who is mastering their emotions and they're going someplace. And there's no stopping them. I feel like with the three of wands, that is a definite decision. The mind is made up. I'm going. I'm going. It, it, it's time. Okay. This is uh, going down that path towards somebody that is extremely powerful. 
you know, the Five of Swords is severing ties. Severing, somebody may be severing ties with another person. I'm just being honest. They may be pushing somebody else away. Maybe that's why action is being taken. There is definitely some sort of action that is being taken uh, towards an individual that, that uh, maybe they don't want to miss the opportunity. They don't want to lose the opportunity with the magician reverse. Magician upright is a golden opportunity, but it's reversed. So it's the, there, somebody may be losing an opportunity and that's why they're taking action. There's a proposal here or an offer of love. There is messages of love. I feel like this is unpredictable. It's unpredictable. We have somebody here that is unpredictable. I have a sneeze coming. I'm trying to hold it in. I couldn't hold it in. It came just like that. It was unpredictable. I couldn't hold it in. So I feel like we have somebody here that can't hold it in. They can't hold it in. They can't hold their feelings in or they can't restrain themselves. Like, ooh, damn. We have the Empress on the bottom. And I didn't look. I didn't look. So we have an Empress here. Um, mm, I didn't. I sneezed and I blew my nose and turned it right back on. <laughs> so, uh, this is a new star. It is a birth of a new life. We have a creator here. This is very sexy. There's some sort of sexy situation going on here. Sensual. There is there is some sort of sex appeal with the with the Queen of Wands, the King of Wands, and the Empress. Um, Empress is a giver of life. She's beautiful. She's she's the goddess of love. She brings a love love and abundance. Domestic goddess creating a new life. So somebody is about to uh, start a new life. They're about to start a new life. It's definitely time. I saw that from the beginning with the three of wands. It's time. And I and I don't I don't know, but. I didn't want to say it, but I'm going to. When I first looked at this card, the Three of Wands, I said to myself, "Here comes the bride." So I don't, I don't know if this leads to marriage, and and this could definitely be a marriage proposal. So somebody may be eventually getting a marriage proposal. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. They could be. They could be. We definitely have somebody here that is about to take action. <clears throat> This is this is the queen of all queens, right? This is the queen of all queens. This is this is it. I also feel like we have somebody here that is severing ties with another person because of that five of swords that is pointed at the queen of wands. It's like severing ties with another person, male or female. You know, I feel like they're severing ties. They may be telling somebody else no. I'm exhausted. I'm fed up. Somebody may be literally telling somebody that. And they may be, um, maybe they have deep feelings for somebody else. There's some sort of deep, deep, deep connection here with the high priestess. That's a very, very uh, mysterious, uh, alluring energy. It is. And this King of Wands appears to be uh, coming in the nick of time in the nick of time. Six of Cups, something that leads to marriage. I keep seeing marriage. There's something that is happening that leads to marriage. There's some sort of uh, reawakened memories of love here. Feelings of love, feeling familiar. Falling in love. Somebody's fallen in love. <clears throat> Or they're deepening a bond. 
there's a soulmate connection here. There is because when we have two of the same court, you know, that's a, that's a, that's a perfect match. It's a soulmate connection. It's meant to be. And there's memories. There's, there's reawakened memories of love. It's feeling, deep feelings of love. There's definitely a soulmate connection here. Oh my God. You ready for this? There's definitely a soulmate connection here. The two of cups. The two of cups. This is this is a partnership that it's a match made in heaven. This is love. This is love. This is this is love. Making an agreement. Connecting. This is a definite love connection. This is this is a face to face. Deepening a bond. We could have some, we could have a relationship that is just starting. There is some sort of face to face. There is a face to face here. This is getting together, falling in love, deepening a bond. It's a very easy connection. It's very easy. It's perfect. It is. It's a perfect match. Removing an obstacle. Eight of Swords reverse. An obstacle is being removed. Somebody's been held back by fear or they've been trapped in their mind. They've been trapped in their thoughts. They've been playing it safe. This is somebody that is that is going to be protecting another person as well. We have a protector here. So we definitely have a protector here. This person is going to be saving somebody as well. Saving somebody because I feel, I feel like we have a savior here. Somebody is about to reveal something. They're about to reveal something that they have been keeping to themselves. They're looking for love. They're looking for a relationship. They're looking for a partnership. They have some sort of connection with somebody that they feel very familiar with. Severing ties maybe with somebody from the past Five of Swords, Six of Cups, Queen of Wands, somebody with another person, with another, because the Queen of Wands can represent another woman. Could also have another man here. And the Five of Swords is severing ties. It is. So some, and there's an obstacle that is being removed. You know, maybe we have somebody here that is done with the Four of Swords reversed. They're done. They're done. Um, isolating themselves they're done uh, wasting time or they needed to think of they're done thinking they're done thinking that's what it is they're done thinking about it definite decision is being made to go down a path it's like the, this is it this is it this is it and whatever this is I, it, it, I I feel like it leads to marriage because I, I keep seeing these marriage cards. Six of Wands, this is your hero, your protector. This is a winner. You're about to see some progress. This is somebody that is definitely taking action. Definitely. This is somebody that is a skilled fighter. Um, that does not give up when the going gets rough. This is somebody who is a winner. This is a winner. Somebody that is going to be taking the lead. This is a leader. This is somebody that is taking the lead. They, they are ready to butt battle. They're ready to fight. They're ready to fight for something. This is somebody who, obviously there's a competition because the five of wands comes before the six of wands. This is somebody that is ready to fight. They're ready to fight. They're ready to win and they're going to win. They're going to win this competition. They're going to win this battle. So somebody is about to take action to win. 
to win. Maybe it's to win somebody's heart because of the Knight of Cups. We do have a union here. It is a perfect match. Somebody has been not taking action with the magician reversed. They were unwilling to take action. Maybe uh, they were being haunted by fear or there's some sort of haunting here. They were haunted by fear or they were worried about what everybody was going to say or they were restricting themselves because they were playing it safe but we definitely have a savior arriving or a hero or whatever it is. This, the Six of Wands is a hero, right? This is somebody that is very strong, that is very skilled, that this is a warrior, right? That has already won several battles. This person has a lot of experience and they're about to uh, embark on another battle. It's like, I'm ready, I'm ready. That one's I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. And I see I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready for this. The decision is made. I almost, I almost want to say that there, there's something else that is non-negotiable, and I, I don't, I don't know what that, who that's for, or, or how it resonates. But this is non-negotiable. I must do this. I gotta do this. This is definitely taking action. It's taking fast action. Now the six of wands is reversed. This is losing. It's because they're losing. Right now they're losing. They're losing. They're losing to the competition because they haven't put in any effort. They haven't put in much effort. Somebody is losing. They're losing. They haven't put in much effort. They haven't, they've given up. And so they're losing. They're losing a golden opportunity next to Magician Reverse by not taking any action. It's almost gone. You know, it's like it's almost dead. I mean, the Four of Swords, the Four of Swords is like, a, it's almost like a death card, okay? And it's right next to this King of Wands. And that person, like, it's like it's almost dead. You, you need to go right now. Or And I wouldn't say that it's a dead, I wouldn't say that it's a... A person per se it's like I mean I, I mean I don't know but the four of swords is like it's almost dead you got to take action right now it's almost gone it's almost too late it's almost too late there's definitely some sort of competition here with the six of wands because the five of wands is right before it and we've had it twice somebody is losing they're losing and the only way they're gonna win and it's like I want to win I want to win and if you want to win then you got to uh, it's almost like show up with the chariot card. You gotta, you gotta find your, you gotta show up. So, seven of cups in reverse on the bottom. That is seeing clearly what the best choice is. Receiving some clarity, coming out of con confusion, making a clear choice. And the Three of Wands is making a definite decision. Before that is the Two of Wands. Somebody has been struggling. They've been struggling with, should I stay or should I go? What should I do? Should I step into unknown territory, you know, or should I stay put? Somebody's been playing it safe. They've been indecisive. That's where they've been. But there is some sort of feelings here. You know, there is feelings. There's some sort of connection. It's a deep one. It is a deep connection. So anyway, I feel like we have somebody here that is ready. They're ready to uh, commit. If you think about that three of wands I showed you, it's like, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. So get prepared for somebody to take serious action. This is somebody that uh, doesn't want to lose. They don't want to lose. And it feels like they've been losing. They're losing, they're losing. A secret is about to be revealed. I, f I feel like somebody has been hiding themselves, you know? An obstacle is about to be removed. Maybe we, we have somebody here that lacked self-confidence. They didn't have the confidence. They didn't, they didn't want to 
show their vulnerability. But there's an opportunity for big love here, but it comes with expression and communication and taking action. So, because there's uh, there's a lot of action that is about to be taken. This is a perfect match. It is a it is a perfect 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 match that leads to marriage. You know, and if you are already married, I don't know if there's a severing of ties cuz there's another woman. I mean, I hate to say that shit. I do. But we got the five of swords pointing at the queen of wands, and the queen of wands can definitely uh you know, it is it could be another woman. It could also be another man. Five of Swords is severing ties. This this is this is there's no victory. Six of Wands reverse, there's no victory here. It's a dead end. I mean I hate to say that, but that's what I see. It's removing an obstacle and following the heart. And if that's the way it is, if there's if there if you're in a situation where, you know, there's no success then the most practical thing to do is to sever the ties even though it's not easy but anyhow there's strength here we definitely have somebody here that is very strong determined confident they're finding their confidence after I feel like they didn't have it you know I, they didn't have it obviously and they were restricting themselves and confining themselves to a situation that was causing them a lot of depression with the Four of Swords reversed. It was causing them a lot of uh, maybe even illness, you know what I mean? Because when you're not happy, it, it well, stress causes every other illness in your body, just saying. Um, Anyway, get prepared. Get prepared for somebody to express their love or their feelings or take action. This is somebody that has a vision. They, they are seeing that they have an, a, a better option or they're seeing something very clearly after they've been confused. Maybe they've been exploring all of their options. Seven of Cups is exploring options. You know, but when you get it in reverse, it's like I'm making my choice. The choice, I'm choosing one instead of all the others, you know. So somebody is making a clear choice in regards to love. And this is in regards to love. Good luck.